almost time to go, ladies. Gabby's, Sylvie's eating popcorn for breakfast. Gabby's eating popcorn and cat food. I'm not eating cat food. I'm not eating cat food. I'm carrying it down I here. I forgot my go. baby. And Ruby's eating snow for breakfast. Winter Wonderland again. We got a lot of snow. Lot Guys, night. it's cloudy with a chance of meatballs. It's cloudy with a whole because, lot of snow. No, it's cloudy with a chance of meatballs because you oh. can form the snow into a meatball. Well, I'm, gonna I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall too. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. It is glorious out. I see a big, huge thumbprint. Right, open the door, Miss New Bra Girl. Ah! Hi, Sky. Did you guys see in yesterday's video? Sam went up to Sky and she curled into him. Traitor. She loves him. She loves Dad best. Come on, let's go. She loves her. Right, you guys do that. Today, we're actually having riding lessons. I feel really awful. We did not have many riding lessons last week. I'm one of those people that feels guilty if our horses are just sitting there doing nothing for a long period, but it's winter in Canada and life turn, shuts down. Life shuts down, you guys. Oh, I was away with Kaylee over yeah. the weekend. And Gabby shut down. She left us and had a fun time. I see them there. Oh my gosh, you'll never believe what happened to Sophie. When Gabby was away, Sophie was playing online with all her little friends, and it was like late, like 10.30 at night, and Sam and I are so, so tired. And we're like, Sophie, we've got to shut it down now, we're all going to go to bed, like we normally do. And Sophie's like, yeah, I can stay up by myself. And we're like, okay. So she said, don't worry, I'll come and kiss you when I'm ready to go to bed. I wake up at like midnight, because Sophie went into her room and closed the door. And I'm like, holy cow, it's midnight. And she just went into her room by herself, so I went to check on her. And she's gonna watch some movies on her phone, just chilling, just hanging out. I'm like, go to bed now! Hey, Olivia, stay up till 2 a.m. Yeah, so she, were you gonna talk to Olivia while I you watched the movie? I stayed up till 4 a.m. You stayed up till 4 a.m.? No wonder you were so thirsty. Olivia and I got hungry. So we were up in the middle of the night. We were go making Mr. Noodles, but we didn't make it in the kitchen. Kaylee brought the Mr. Noodles downstairs, and we used hot water from her sink. It tastes the best, though. <laughs> Better than it Mr. always Noodles. tastes the best when you have to improvise. I get the joy of filling all these grain bags today. This is my job. That is what I'm going to do. Woohoo! Yay, me! See how much she wants okay, love. Tail. She just loves this girl. She doesn't like the dynamics of the being at the bottom of the herd so much, but she loves being worked with. She loves being touched. Yeah. All right, we are done in the barn this morning. This is all the grain. I know it's insane. We're gonna put it in the back of my truck. That's the stuff. Van. I don't need a truck. Don't you think I need a truck? 
I need a truck so I can. I want a truck, you guys. It just occurred to me, like, I'm a woman. I'm a happening woman. And I'm gonna be carrying a lot of grain. Mom, do you want this one to be here? No, I'm good. I got it. Sylvie, can you turn off the light? Oh man, Mom. <sighs> Mom do All right, as long as nothing breaks. Okay, light. Huh. All right, we're gonna make it. Barn is clean. Anyways, I. How are you putting the camera? What if I had a What if I had a truck, Gabby? Don't you think that'd be amazing? Uh -huh. Sylvie, you want a truck? So it. Truck. It's, and it's gonna be one of those little tiny itty bitty ones. Sophie's gonna get herself a truck. And then, hey, someone's here. Oh. I'm getting a Lamborghini. Oh, the propane. Can you close the door? Somebody's gotta close I can't the door. Close the door. Gabby, you gotta close the I door. Can't. Somebody I has to close the door. Okay, hurry, Soph. Don't stand in front of me because my arm oh, could my get about at any moment. I'm an old lady. My arm's already getting. Get out of my way. It's all fair and love and horses, you guys. Get the heck out of my way! Oh, I can't even hack it. I have to put you guys away. All right, Sophie, show them. Show them the thing that you love. Did that come from the pro propane truck? Oh. Sam got this yesterday from the roof. Oh. That big, huge ice it candy. Was before, it was like up to here. Ice lollipop what? is Sophie's oh. dream icicle. I was gonna say my phone, but it's my phone. That's, that's polluted rain that makes that. Yeah, polluted Sophia. precipitation. She's like, all right, I'll eat it outside where nobody can see. <laughs> so much energy today, you guys. I am so excited for everything that's gonna happen today. All the things that I don't know, but that God has planned for me. Anyway, today I am headed into town because Nick needs me to help for a few minutes with the baby. So today is the first day probably ever that I have left the girls to do their schoolwork alone. I've left a note, I, they know what to do. I, it's all set up for them, but I'll be back in a couple hours and see how they're doing. But yeah, it's their first day that I've ever left them to just do their schoolwork. And I'm kind of excited to see how they do. Homeschool is designed to teach you how to teach yourself. That's what school is for. That's the only thing it is for. So that when you go to university or you go to college or you, grow up and you have a career, you know how to learn. You know how to teach yourself. So anyway, yeah, let's go. Jack. Hey, Jack. Say hi. Say Nana. Hey, Nana. What exactly are you doing, Missy? Trying to stand up. They're tired, but they're uneven. Oh. We need to even them out. Uh -oh. So I won't die. <laughs> wow, what a feat that was, Gabby. You're amazing. It is a literally like spring out here. It's so warm, you guys. It is probably it turns dark. seven it's degrees dark. Celsius. All the snow is melting. The horses are outside sunbathing. We're getting ready to go for lessons. Um, Sam has to get hay. Sophia! You jumped on me. I don't care. She jumped on me and I almost fell, so I spilled my snowman. <laughs> Anyway, we're driving with Fiona. I'll tell you more when we get in the car. She's here. Okay, so I bought this olive oil spray for Storm's feet because he literally gets so much ice in there. He's like walking on Perfect. on ice. Do I just spray like all inside where the snow goes after his ride? Yeah, you, just before you turn them out. Just before we turn them out. And carrots, because you always need a good carrot. And hydrogen per peroxide because Four. Storm has cancer. Storm has what? I hope Storm does not have cancer, but I'm freaking out a little. So he has a lump under where his saddle goes, of course. Not directly. Sort of. Where the saddle flap. Where the flap saddle goes. flap goes, yeah, where the flap goes. And so the, the chiropractor was there and she's a vet. In Canada, to be a chiropractor, you have to either be a vet or a chiropractor, right? I think she's a human know. chiropractor. A human chiropractor. So. Um, she is a vet and she looked at it and she said it's just a bunch of cells. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah, that's great. A bunch of cells that are over multiplying or I don't know what they are. But anyway, she said get some hydrogen peroxide and dry them out. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to panic. I'm not going to freak out. But yeah, so that that's that. Okay, we are completely restocked for grain. I have more in our van. Sam's bringing it. I want Chino to finish up that stuff. 
And then I have another bag for him. I was able to make some fun changes though. Like, um, Finn's not getting any kind of feed with molasses in it now. I'm excited. That was like a long change I've been dying to make. Hey, Scarfy. I'm riding Stormo. I wish I was riding the Finn. Aw, oh, you should ride him again. Uh, do you see what's set up in the arena? What's set up in the arena? Bounce, bounce, bounce. bounce. One stride, bounce, bounce, bounce. Amazing. It's scary. I love you, Finny. Oh, He'd be looking so, I don't know. I, he's looking at me like you, you haven't come to see me in days. You want a hug? It wasn't our fault. I promise you. So, Gabby, no, what is the no, plan? You're riding Ham on Tuesdays, Chino on Thursdays? Depends. Monday. Monday, okay. Tuesdays all right. And we'll figure it all out. We'll figure it out, Finny. Mom. I'm scared of that guy down there. Oh, he's a nice horse. Grumpy. Yes! Fiona has OCD about color matching. The poles don't match, so she won't keep this up. But look at how gorgeous this jump is. This line. Gabby wants to do it. I love it. So this must be like a one stride. A uh, jump, what's it called? A hop, a... a Pump. What's it? What's it called? This one. Bounce. This is a bounce. I love it. Three bounces, one stride, three bounces. Yeah, and then. All right, let's keep it. Come on, it's Gabby and Rachel. They can do it. Not what I want to work on. Oh man, <laughs> Gabby, let's get Fiona a chocolate bar. <laughs> and things just got a little more exciting. Finn's gonna jump this for the first time. Actually, has he jumped things like this before? Yes, right. I really want to pull the tree out of the Let's do it. Lay it down. Let's do it. I don't think we can. Why? You think it's tied up there? Like Ooh. Like Finny, we're coming for you. Well, it's going to look unconventional, but we're going to do it. Yeah, it's a little unconventional, but... Holy <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> that goes well it's going under the jump. <laughs> I think it might. Well, I think it might go well. Gabby's in love with this horse. Pony. It's so hard though. Oh look, there's a saddle pad over that jump. Yeah. He's like, he's like, he's already decided. He's like, I'm not doing this day. Oh, there's more saddle pads. Okay, so the lesson, there's no mom squad because it's a strike day for our teachers. Our teachers are on strike, so a lot of kids are out of school, so lessons got all switched up, turned around. So it's just Rachel and Gabby. This is my favorite part of lessons, you guys. Just joking. Oh, she tells her to pick up the canner while I'm picking up the poo. <laughs> Rachel's like, oh, you better get in front if we're gonna canner now. But Finn's like not feeling it. Hopefully. Except for he's feeling the jumper. So, yeah, just tie him up. Just wait, I wanna show them. Where's that little spot on Storm? I don't know. Oh. I think it's gone. So here it is. No, it's not gone. What do you guys think? I thought it was a tick. But the vet, see it? Oh, it looks scary to me with that black center. I don't know. I don't actually think he has cancer. But anytime there's like a cyst or something, okay. it makes me nervous. You guys see it? No. That's it. I'm going to put peroxide on it. Comment below if you have something else that works. 
So I put the peroxide on and it foamed up like it does, like things do. That makes me nervous, you guys. I don't like this. But anyway, I'm gonna treat it every time we come and hopefully she said it'll dry up. The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this cooking spray on his, on his things so that, on his um, horseshoes, inside of his horseshoes so that the snow doesn't stick. Wow, that looks like snow. I'm frozen. I feel like getting warm. Whose bag is that? So I treat. Yeah. Oh, you'll be sweaty. Poor boy.